High school students in one town will soon be able to go maskless in class. But as WBZ's Lisa Greshi explains, the change is only temporary. Starting November 1st, vaccinated students can show their faces again here at Hoppington High. The school becoming the first in the state to ditch the mandate. And I'm really happy that we broke that barrier, that we made a breakthrough in this COVID pandemic. The students themselves creating a survey for their fellow classmates. And I include a yes or no, and I say why. More than 70% voting yes. I think a lot of students have put in a lot of work with quarantining and monitoring their symptoms and getting vaccinated and everything. Um, so it's nice to see those efforts be rewarded a little bit finally. The vote coming in late Thursday night after students presented the data to the school committee. Thank the amount of hardships that we experienced throughout this time, and now we get to finally have a trial, an experiment. Students walking to school this morning, happy to take the next step. Most of the people I know in the school are vaccinated, so I don't really feel that there's a risk anymore. 98% of the Hoppington High Schoolers are vaccinated, passing the 80% requirement from the Department of Elementary and Secondary Education. The high vaccination rate giving the green light for the mandate to be lifted. I heard it's gonna, there's going to be like an optional period coming up. The students who voted no did raise concerns. Flu season, spreading COVID to younger unvaccinated siblings, and future variants. All factors that would ultimately call for this to be considered a trial run. I am so proud. In the meantime, many will be looking forward to the next maskless chapter. To be able to have somewhat of a normal school experience again, even if it's just for a trial period and see how that goes, um, and maybe have some events like pep rally and powder puff and all those things back again without masks. Now, unvaccinated students still have to mask up, and for the week of Thanksgiving, everyone will have to wear a mask because of holiday travel. Reporting from Hopkinton, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.